Now to your full forecast, Chief Meteorologist Tony Petraca joins us now. And Tony, a, a sunny Earth Day, but we still are dealing with some lingering chilly temperatures. Yeah, these late night, early morning temps have uh, caused us to reissue the, uh, the frost advisory, Kayla, for late tonight. Actually, per the National Weather Service, late tonight through uh, early tomorrow morning. Beautiful in Providence and all around, just tons of sunshine and blue skies. Let's take you to uh, New Bedford Harbor right now. Bright, breezy and dry. Temperatures are in the 50s, some spots in the upper 50s other areas a little cooler. Yeah, speaking of cold overnight early this morning down to about 30 35. Those are a bit milder uh, in Newport and we have similar temperatures coming up for tonight. Now when we say tonight we're really pre dawn uh, four, five, six o'clock in the morning. So the frost advisory has been reissued for the entire area from 11 o'clock tonight till seven o'clock tomorrow morning. And keep in mind the average date of the last frost around here is typically the first uh, week of May. So not that unusual, but the temperature is below average. I mean, the, the low temperature at, at night usually is around 40. It will be well below that tonight. Many areas now uh, in the upper 50s to lower 60s, jumping the 62 in Providence, 57 uh, New Bedford and Taunton now at the 58 degrees. So skies are clear, uh, nice and quiet, really the eastern half of the country. Our next weather system for Wednesday, bringing us some scattered showers for midweek. So let's take this into the future. Watch the time bar. Skies will stay clear tonight and chilly. Uh, here we are pre-dawn around 4 or 5 in the morning. Look at that temperature anywhere from about 30 to 35 degrees with really a pretty impressive storm system offshore that will stay away. We've got more sunshine on the way. So as chilly as it is at sunrise tomorrow morning it does recover to the upper 50s in the afternoon. Your Tuesday looks good system to our west will bring us some scattered showers both uh, Wednesday morning and Wednesday afternoon. Here we are at 8 a.m. There may be a little sneak peek of sun in the afternoon and a second chance for some isolated showers by late afternoon and early evening. Skies are clear for uh, Wednesday night. It sets up for even colder weather, at least at sunrise on Thursday morning at 6 a.m. Temperatures actually getting below freezing. Thursday's a sunny day, but it's pretty chilly at sunrise. Probably another frost advisory will be issued at that time. So despite the chill early in the morning, here we are in the afternoon with temperatures generally in that 55 to 60 range inland. Uh, notable sea breeze will keep the south shore probably in the lower 50. So that cold start early tomorrow morning. Sunshine gets to work by 11 a.m. We're at 55 and generally upper 50s inland tomorrow with lots of sunshine. Lower 50s with the sea breeze along the shoreline. Bay forecast reflects that sea breeze south at 5 to 10 gusts to 20 knots in the afternoon and the visibility is unlimited water temperatures in the upper 40s. So looking good the remainder of the afternoon and early evening. Uh, not bad for Tuesday. There are scattered showers on Wednesday, Thursday and Friday looking OK. And right now a vast majority of the weekend is looking OK. There is a slight chance of a shower on Sunday, but Sunday is warmer with temperatures in the 60s. Kim and Mike.